Welcome back, guys. My name is Sablin, and you're welcome back to <laughs> part five or Daybreak V two. I can never know. I I still do not know how to do my intro correctly. Well, um, uh, okay. Just want a small update. I did do some upgrading, minor upgrading in between parts, and uh, that will be my project E. So last time you saw, I had one Torturino with just one M. Uh, Mark 1 energy collected. Now I have 4 Mark 1s, 2 double comp. Uh, two, 2 compressed Torturinos and uh, 1 normal Torturino. Uh, oh yeah, I've also got myself a alchemy table and upgraded my furnaces to diamond because, you know. Uh, okay, so I have also made a, a small change because when I was actually upgrading my Project E, I found out that I wasn't doing it correctly. In this particular mod pack, this was a new mod that added in into this version, or at least my playthrough version that includes the last version we played, or the or the ones I I uploaded. That is Project X. Now Project X was really interesting to me because I never really pay attention to it because like I was like Project X. I thought I added it because like oh it seems cool, you know what I mean? Added all these kind of things, but I didn't realize that you look at this. Generates EMC only once. And then you look at Mark 5, Mark 16, 48 trillion EMC per second. Let me reiterate to you again. 48 trillion, 9, sorry, 12 zeros, 12, 1, 2, 12 zeros, holy sh**. I, I, I think, I think, I think T means trillion. I mean like M. Like, see, a th is it million, million, million. This is, has to be a billion. I don't know why it's G, but it's a, it's a billion. And now it's a trillion. Like, what the hell? Huh? Can someone explain that to me? What? What? What is that? Because in Auxilium, and it's, it's, Auxilium is pretty OP in itself, I have to say, huh? Pretty, pretty OP in itself. Look at this, 10,240 EMC per second, only 10,000. If you look back at Project X again, let's see, look at this. Just in Mark 5, we already exceeded Mark 7. Insane, isn't it? Insane. So, I think we should be, first of all, in the background, I'm going to upgrade my all my Mark 1 to Mark 7. I'll go all the way for Auxilium. Reason being is that I think we just double one, one double compressed Torturino for like a full 4 Mark 7 energy collector with a Mark 2 energy condenser chest should be enough for most things. I feel like the only reason why I would actually need any of this, right, is for you, you guys say Avaratia with their infinity ingots and catalysts and all that. <laughs> so. Yeah, I didn't know that I, I actually added that. Okay, so first up on the list, we're not going to upgrade anything here as of yet. We're going to create ourselves some extreme reactors. Now, I'm going to start off small first. There's no, there's no need for me to start off big. So, I think it's 32 for 1. If I remember. If my... Memory served correctly. It's 32 for 1. So let me grab myself this double compressed because it'll be faster. Look at that. Oh, oh you're done. I, I didn't even manage to get to see it. Look at that. Just... Look at that. Hmm? Not sure you know, man. Okay. So first of all, we need reactor casing. And with that, we need a lot of iron. We need a lot of gold. And we need a lot of redstone. So next up, iron, redstone, yeah, we're going to pick it all of this. Okay, so let's make ourselves some tier casing. So let's just make, we're just going to make one. We're just going to make one. First, I did duplicate all those resources, but they were, I didn't expect it to be that slow. Hmm. Let me try 
Maybe I should uh, actually improve it. Okay, guys, let's get ourselves a Mark II in the meantime, then. So, which, you know, we don't need any more of this. So, to get a Mark II. Ah, can I spell it correctly? MK2. We need Glowstone and uh, this thingy bob. So, we get one. But I think we need more than. And that gives me this. And then you know what? We duplicate this. Okay, we got eight. Nice. Amazing. And then we. Boom. Guys. Come on, man. Coming smart. Well, that is duplicating. We shall increase this with our glowstone. Dumbak too. That will help it quite a lot, I think. Quite a bit. Okay. So while this is duplicating, let's go create ourselves a platform with the uh, I think yeah. So we our spear I, I guess it's in that earlier, but it's, it's, we're gonna create like a spear or at least a circle in this direction. I want my to be somewhere here. I don't want it to be exactly next door, but uh so one, two, three. So somewhere, somewhere around here is where my reactor should be at. Yeah, somewhere there, somewhere there. Let's go sleep first. Okay, let's just take normal cobblestone first and let's mark out where I want my things to be. So, strictly speaking, right, we're going to use quite a lot of space for all our machines. So, if we're saying that we'll use seven, okay, let's, like, let's, Nicely put it around seven. We want our reactor to be somewhat. Oh, you know what? No, no, no. Let's do this a bit differently. Okay, with our. Oh, it's almost done. Nice. And done. This will give us a stack, right? Yeah, stack. Okay, so I don't want it to be so close. One, two, three. So around here is where the reactor will begin. We need some space in between, I believe. So this is where the blocks will be at. This is where the wires will be at. This is where a certain amount of things will be at. So if we're taking it into a it should be somewhere here. Okay. Next up, uh, how big of a reactor do I want it to be? We can make it a 5x5, five five, but you know, since we got Project E, let's just make it a 7x7. Seven seven. Like, why the hell not? Even in the previous series, we went for 7x7. Seven seven. So, one, that's a 5, so we need to extend a little bit more. Yeah, that should be enough. I mean, I remember I didn't create a very big reactor back then, but hey, this like, screw it, right? Like, okay, let's create a big one from the start. Because remember last time a five x five is more than enough. But let's let's postpone the need for like, let's say a eleven by eleven reactor. Okay, so ah, uh, it's a bit hard. I, I when I got my external mic, I'm still kind of new to using external mic compared to like uh, a headphone mic. <laughs> Unlike a headphone mic, an external mic will actually block your view, which in some ways it blocked my hotbar. It's a bit harder to, to see. Okay, so two is enough. So let's change this and this. So we want to get more glowstone as well. So we got two. Look at that. Look at all that. Okay. So. Okay, let's hope it doesn't duplicate. Oh, it's fast. But, uh. That's because it's already pre, pre, preloaded in. More. Ah, okay, so this is our frame. That is our frame. Yeah, that looks. That looks. That looks fine. Looks really fine. 
Okay, so next stop, let's create Mark 3 in the background in the meantime. So Mark 3 requires this much, so let's just duplicate uh, that in the background. Uh, I think it'll be slightly faster now. Yeah, a bit, but slightly faster indeed. Okay, so now we need rods. Right, a rod. Uh, yeah, here we go. Break the fuel rod. So we need to smell our yellorium or uranium, whichever we have. So we only need one for obvious reasons. We do need quite a bit of this. 4,000 and it's still kind of slow. I'm kind of disappointed, to say the least. <laughs> okay, it's, I think that's, that's all right. And voila, two rods. And uh, yeah, one is enough. We can duplicate the rest. I think we need five, 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 five. So twenty. Yeah, we we could twenty one because one extra. So we can always it should like with project E, you should always keep one of everything so you can duplicate it anytime you need to. So we needed we needed this. Wasting a piston, you say? Not anymore. Hola. So just need four of this, so. Okay. There we go. Created exactly four with one extra, about right. Ah, uh, hold up. Reactor casing. We need. We need somewhat. Yeah, I think 20 is enough. Okay. Okay, so it should be here, 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 here. Hey, look at that. Oop. Okay. Next up, we need to get ourselves uh what you call that controller which is this one and uh oh oh forgot how expensive that was so we're missing everything tree stone tree stone we just use one stick i think yeah let's 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 try to stretch it a little bit is one stick enough no it's not oh one stick's in one stick is enough for two items. The last time you need two sticks for one item. Ah, not bad, not bad. Okay. Okay, so we have... Redstone torches. Do, do, do. And... Voila. And voila. Boom. Okay. Next up, we need... Access port, yes. So, access port, what we're missing? Casing. We need more casing, you see? More casing. Boom. Uh, look at that. Look at that. Ex access. No, 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 sorry, no. This access. This is in inside. Yeah. Okay, next, we need redstone port. Redstone flux power port. Yeah, so we just need... Okay, we're almost there. We're almost there, guys. Almost there. Last material we need, besides the coolant, is reactor glass. Not turb not, not turbine glass, uh, reactor glass. Which is... uh Yeah, we should take 10. And duplicate the rest. Hey, look at that. Nice. 69. <laughs> okay, so let's put it here. And I... One by one. Oh. Hey, would you look at that? Would you look at that? Would you look at that? Okay. Last part of the reactor 
can't even jump. There you go. Okay, so strictly speaking, this should be all that is required for a reactor. And yep, that is correct. Okay, so we need uranium. So we're just gonna duplicate uranium. So we're gonna put extra uranium there, obviously. But uh, we're done with this. Okay, next up, apply energistics. Okay, I don't know how long I've been recording. How long I've been recording already? Not long. Only been like twenty minutes, I think. Maybe I don't know, half an hour. Okay, let's. Apply energistics. Hell yeah, I didn't spell that wrong. Okay, first up is that we need this. So we need, oh. Don't mind if I got them do. Ah, ah, ah. We did do. Okay, so. We need a diamond pickaxes for sure, so that's my travels. Uh, wait, where did I put my? Oh, right here. Okay, so we're gonna bring extra. We're gonna keep all these resources. Since we probably wouldn't need any of them to be honest. And uh, yep, let's put it on. Are you okay? That's that's more than enough. That's more than enough. We're gonna stick a stack in here for. Extra and uh, let's go look for our inscriber press. So, if we're, we're gonna keep this both on at hand because we need to know which one we don't have. Okay, it's daytime. Let's let's move. Wait, one thing I forgot is that we need to create a waypoint. This is our base, so B base. Let's keep it green. Safe. Nice. And let's bring our bed. Because I want to sleep wherever we are at. Don't want to have any mobs on our way back. Respawn is not really an issue when we have waypoints. Like, let's be honest. Respawn is only... It's, like, it's just to make sure you... It's, it's a, it's a fail-safe to always get back to your base. But we have, a, we have a map. So we're good. I just wonder, what mods out there will be worth adding to Minecraft? There's so many different mods in Minecraft, but like, not a lot of them will be, I'll say, will be great to, oh, it's under us. Would be a good idea to actually add into Minecraft. Pistol was one of the rare mods that was useful. Are we still not there yet? Is this, is this, is this here? How low must we go? Okay, what? Are you serious? Are you serious? I swear to god, this compass can be a scam sometimes. Look, this is why, back in the last series, I said I used X-ray for. It's so I can spot where the meter is exactly because you can see that this this kind of thing happens. I have no idea how, but it happens, and it's not cool. Are you sure it's here? Okay, we're gonna we're gonna dig here then. How about here? Okay, you know what? Okay, let's put a shovel here. I'm getting scammed, aren't I? Just full on scam. I'm 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 getting scammed. I'm very well getting scammed again. When blocking should come back, your so uh, swap blocking should come back. I mean, it's old combat. It was far superior compared to this one. If you don't think so, you just you just stupid. I said so. You are just stupid. Ah, nice. That's one. Hopefully, it's in the surface. Because I like to mine a meteor that I can see. 
Thank you. Very cool. Oh. Open GL error. Damn. Okay, where's the meter? I, I, I look. I bit. Ah, oh my god. Hey, hey, it's here. I knew. I knew you were me. Ah, uh, you know what? Screw it. We're hit. We're heading to those meteors. We found any in the, in, in in the way, then go for us. I'm not gonna get you better by another underground meteor. Like it's definitely there, guys. I I, I know. Like for some of you guys, like you, you, you probably know, but I'm not gonna waste my time trying to find a meteor that I can't really see. It's only a couple. Uh, it's one and a half thousand blocks away. It's only only one and a half thousand blocks away. I traveled further before, so it's all right. Well. I guess marking down those earlier three meteorites was a good idea, huh? We get no meteorites near my area, or at least the ones near my area I got to be that hard. Like, bloody hard. Now I just reminiscent of old time. Wow, it could be that far off, huh? What a Oh, okay. We got, we got, we got, we got, we got one. I, I, I'll take the thin, I guess, and the sky chest. Next stop. Ah, uh, uh, hunger. Right there. Let's go, Kobe. The only thing I like about mods, right, is that some materials, right. Actually, no, sorry, let me rephrase that. What I like about mods, at least one point, one aspect of what I like about mods and mod bags in general, is the... is the different... Uh, how should I say? Oh. Things you could do in a, in a mod bag. Oh my god, the wrong one again. So let me... Wait, let me... Let me phrase this. Okay, so one thing I really, 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 really like, which I always remember this because it's how hard it is for, for, it to, for you to do in just normal Minecraft. Heck, not even... Even in the model, it's, it's still as hard. Is to obtain... Slime balls. But in a mod pack like this, there are many different alternatives to slime balls. Like, how should I say this? Like, so if there was an if a particular recipe requires a slime ball, there will be also other items slime ball like that will be accepted, and it's a lot easier to to get. One of them is a uh, a rice ball. Is it a rice ball? I don't know, but it was made out of rice, and that's a lot easier, a lot easy to do. Like as soon as you meet a uh, uh, what you call it? Uh, as soon as you found this rice seeds, you're good. You you effectively obtain slime balls in in a way, which was really really nice. Hello there, wolves. I don't have any bones with me, so I can't really tame you guys. Though it would be nice. No, I think having a wolf sometimes can be a bit too annoying. Obtaining flowers just in case. Never know. Never, never, never know when you need to die. You know what I mean. You, you know what I mean. Oh, the Minecraft sound there. I gotta say, man, Minecraft like sound effects is really, really, really creepy for a kids' game. It's just creepy. Like you could put this in a horror game and it wouldn't stick out at all. Like n not, not at all, man. And I think I think that's an issue in in itself, right? Why is there creepy sound effects in a game like this? Not that it stand out in this game. You know, she doesn't stand out at all. But like, why? Okay, come on, come on, come on. Oh no. Hmm. Is there a way for me to just? 
We'll just grab you and we do that. Grab you to here. Okay. This is in the middle, right? Um. Yes. Ah. Oh. We got all of them guys. We got we got them. Amazing guys. Amazing. Okay, so time to make our way back. Three thousand blocks away, so hey. It was actually worth it to do this. Ow. Oh, can I Hey, follow me, brother. Follow me. Let's go. We are on a trip. We a favorite rocket ship. Dude, I forgot. I forgot. I forgot what is it called. And I don't think I'll shoot. I want to play here. I, I, I don't think I want to add the effect. Both of the thinkers. Copyright. Let's go, buddy. I don't have a name tag for you, but we can create one. I'm very, very sure we can create one. Okay, boy, get in the boat. Wait, yeah, in, uh, in the boat. In the boat. No, 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 no. Yeah, there we go. Now we're going to place us. Slay, pretty slick. Hey, hey, hey. This is one reason why I decided to build a base next to an ocean or a big source of water. It's so, there's two modes of transportation. Water, I mean, sea and land, pretty much, which is pretty nice. Oh yeah, but uh, speaking about the slime balls again, Deckard's Contra is also one thing. It makes getting slime balls easier because you can get slime balls on top of this island. If I failed to mention that any time earlier. I mean, we haven't started like, Thinkers yet, right? We're only in part 4, is that right? We're part... Wait, no, wait a minute. We are part... No, we're part 5. Sorry, this is part... I, look, I, I, I lose track. Of what part I'm at, really, because I'm just playing the game. It just shows you how immersed I am. In, in, in a way, immersed, you know. Wow, we are back in base. Before we end off, let me just create a name tag. I think we can create a name. No, we cannot. Hmm, interesting. Some dungeons and mine shop. Fourteen to twenty-nine stacks. Seventeen to. I have no idea what they mean, but it means something. Okay, well, you're gonna stay nameless for some amount of time. Uh, and uh, a bit. Hey, look at that. Let me just shift you inside a bit. Okay, well, that marks off this uh this part, guys. So we we gotten what we wanted in a way. We in no way did we fail in obtaining anything we want, which is amazing. That's the first, in, in a way, the first. We got all the inscriber, calculation press, engineering press, logic press, silicon press. We are definitely going to start on um, applying logistic next next part. So I'm going to max this out to Mark 7. We are going to then do Project X in the background and then start on pro, uh, applying logistics. And if there's any time, we can begin on thermals. I, I realize one hour is not really a lot to do much, but uh, we're making good progress. So till then, guys, this is part five, I believe. Next one is part six. I'll see you guys there. Bye bye.